Hi there and welcome back. Before I can start tiling next week, which will be something like the grand finale, I have to do some prep work and we will work from top to bottom. So first we will start and cork the joints between ceiling and walls. Afterwards I will try to install the down lights so that there are no more cables hanging out of the ceiling. And there is a little change in my design plan. I know that I said in the very beginning I want to tile this wall behind the vanity, but I think it will be too many tiles, so I will paint this wall as well and there will just be a backsplash behind the sink. So lots to do this weekend, let's get started. Cables hanging from the ceiling, gaps as huge as the Mariana Trench and an ugly green wall. Let's fix this. Honestly, today's episode is just a stopgap solution. Because of the worldwide supply chain disruption due to Covid, I am waiting for my ordered tiles to be delivered. Instead of sitting around and doing nothing, I decided to tie up all these loose ends. The good thing with this project is that there is always something to do and fix. Many of you asked in the comments of last week's episode why there is still this massive gap between wall and ceiling and why I paint the walls before caulking these gaps. Well, my plan was to install some crown molding in the end and this would cover all the nooks and crannies. But you convinced me that it would be better to cork these joints anyway. And being a good YouTuber, I always listen to my subscribers. Not that I would need an excuse, but I did not gain weight. I am wearing three layers of sweaters and two pairs of trousers. Most of all I am mentioning this for my mom, who always gives me a call after watching a new episode and asking me exactly this question. So mom, the answer is no, I didn't. Actually, I even lost some kilos. Next task on the list? Getting rid of all these loose cables and, even more important, installing some proper LED light in this room. I cut and strip the cables off camera.
and much better. So, no more need of this studio light. It would always be in my way anyway, once the shower is installed. Next project, the backsplash behind the vanity. In the beginning I thought it would look very elegant to have a tiled accent wall behind the vanity, but the room is too small for all these darker tiles, so a simple backsplash should be enough. Someone told me that it would be better not to tile over paint. So I mark the area for the backsplash and paint just the rest of the wall. No, Andre, that's too small. A backsplash like this would look ridiculous. So, lights installed, joints corked, and everything more than ready for tiling. Fingers crossed that they arrive this week. Otherwise, I would install the vanity first, cause this one is on stock. Thank you all for watching and see you all next week. Until then, stay safe and stay healthy.